Now, scientists in Chile have unveiled dozens of fossils that they found in the country's Atacama Desert. The bones come from various animals that lived millions of years ago. Perhaps the biggest find was the jaw of a giant shark that's become something of a celebrity in recent years. Tim Ullman has the story. Some call this the desert graveyard, an arid, desolate place. But dig down deep beneath the sand and the topsoil, and it is somewhere rich with hidden knowledge. Fossils and bones, an insight into life on this planet from another age. We found different types of vertebrates. Without a doubt, one of the most striking is a wonderfully large fish, a shark. It's the Megalodon. It's famous because of the Hollywood movie The Meg. And here is one of the places in the world where the largest number of their teeth have been found. And this is what that wonderfully large fish might have looked like. It's believed the megalodon lived somewhere between 23 million and 3.6 million years ago. They could grow up to around 20 metres in length, a fierce and terrifying predator. Quite the discovery, but no surprise to anyone around here. Atacama is nature's laboratory to understand the origins of the universe, also to understand how vertebrates have evolved, as well as the lineage of marine animals over the last eight million years. After being neglected for decades, around two and a half thousand hectares of this land are now preserved as a protected site, a place for discovery and the uncovering of secrets. Tim Allman, BBC News.